New at 6, Congresswoman Lucy McBath is set to challenge fellow Democrat Carolyn Bordeaux for the District 7 seat as congressional lines are redrawn in Georgia. McMath handily won District 6 last year, but the new map turns it into a Republican-friendly territory, leading McBath to instead seek another term in District 7, which Bordeaux narrowly won last year. Joe Hankey is walking us through the impact on, on all of this politics, which is now reshuffled here in our zip codes. Jeff, Representative Lucy McBath sent out details of her plan to leave the 6th District and head to the 7th District minutes after the Georgia House approved the state's new congressional map earlier today. The map still needs Governor Brian Kemp's signature, but this appears to signal Republicans could gain a House seat in D.C. Representative Lucy McBath in 2018 flipped Georgia's 6th District from red to blue when she defeated then-Congresswoman Karen Handel. It's so nice to meet you. Very Please nice call me Karen. And McBath earned a second term when she defeated Handel in a rematch two years later. Republicans previously held the district since 1979 when Newt Gingrich was elected to his first of 10 terms. What the majority party will often do is to eliminate some of its opposition. UGA political science professor Charles Bullock says through redistricting, Republicans now seem destined to reclaim the 6th, as the party seeks to also reclaim the House in D.C. McBath district, she's right. She has become much more Republican, and she would have virtually no chance of winning in that. McBath, in a statement today, wrote, Census data showed Georgia's 6th needed the least population change of any congressional district in the state, and yet Georgia Republicans shifted the district I currently hold 26 points to Trump to draw me out of Congress. The map sent to Governor Kemp adjusts the boundaries of the Democratic-leaning 6th and 7th districts. Lawmakers removed left-leaning voters of color in DeKalb County from the 6th and replaced them with mostly white voters in Dawson and Forsyth counties. The 7th remains left-leaning. It is where McBath and Representative Carolyn Bordeaux both confirm they plan to seek another term in Congress next year. Bullock says if McBath loses, Republicans might not only pick up a seat in D.C., but could eliminate a vocal voice of the Democratic Party. McBath is one of the most outspoken supporters of gun control and high visibility both in Georgia but also nationally. You know, if she is eliminated, then that removes a potentially important uh, person who would discuss that uh, topic and have great credibility. And Representative Carolyn Bordeaux tells us the newly drawn 7th District contains 60% of her current constituents and is largely located in Gwinnett County where she lives. You can read statements from both McBath and Bordeaux right now on 11alive.com.